As students get ready to head back to the classroom, law enforcement agencies are getting ready for worst case scenarios. The Nash County Sheriff's Office hosted an active shooter training today. CBS 17's Joseph Holloway was there. Several agencies were involved in today's training, including Nash, Edgecombe, and Franklin counties, just to name a few. But the sheriff told me that it is more important than ever before to be ready in case someone walks in and starts firing. The training started off with a gunman firing blanks. Then several students took off running. From there, officers, deputies, and EMS workers became involved in the simulation and worked through what they would do if that situation came up. Rocky Mount Academy student Cameron Dawkins played a big part in the simulation. I was in the shooter room, and then the shooter came in with a gun, started shooting, and then the cop took care of him, and then they took me out, and then they put me on a stretcher. The exercise lasted about 90 minutes, followed by a debriefing to discuss what to take away from the drill. The Nash County Sheriff's Office is just one of several departments to host one of these trainings as we get closer to the start of school. And Sheriff Keith Stone says it's a learning opportunity for both law enforcement and students and teachers. Everybody learns. You can't just talk about it. You've got to add realism to it. When you see so many law enforcement officers and vehicles around, it can naturally be very concerning. And that's why the county says that they went on the social media to make sure that everyone in the community knew that there was no danger. In Rocky Mount, Joseph Holloway, CBS 17 News.